Okay, Coda. Whoa, this place crawls with flies. Oh, here we go. Have, have a look at this one. This is an adult. Probably got a, a bunch of smaller flies and small children in its belly. Oh, it, it, it's a beauty. I, I like I like how big that one is. It it's very quiet. When I'm when I'm handling flies, I try to be as gentle as possible. I don't I don't just grab them by the head like most people deal with flies. No. No. Flies have very delicate backbones. They're very easily damaged. So I like to try to support support the pup right here if I can so it could just gently be destroyed as quickly. Oh, oh blimey. Oh. Oh, blimey! It's coming after us! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, there's no time to hang around on this one. I'm calling the See, SWAT team! As a general rule, you want to use good solid footsteps as you, as you step away from the fly. The reason being, there's a psychological trick with these flies because they can sense the vibrations as we walk. You see, the fly will scatter if it, if it knows that we're close by. If I just shout at it, Hey, fly! It can't hear me at all. But it can tell when I'm walking. You see that? Each footstep, it knows like thunder in the sky of the fly. So we have to be careful. We have to be fair and gentle. See that? See that? Come on. Here we go. Now, very important, you use gentleness and a swift quick oh yeah coda we got it whoa look how big that one was <laughs> that was a huge huge pop oh my gosh oh a satisfying pop of wow coda these children these children they come out from nowhere because the fly knows that they were here whoa <laughs> you, they're very oh they're, they're they're I think they know what what how to catch flies even better than the best. But I've trained them well. I've trained them very well. You see, whoa, that was too much. That was too close. You see, it almost got me right in the face. I have to be really careful. This fly is very aggressive. You see, the reason being is because I've had him cornered. <laughs> so that fly's only form of defense, Ella, is is to fly right up to the nose. You've got to be very careful, very careful. Let's see, Coda. Come on. Come on, let's find the fly. Come on. Where did it go? Oh, you guys, look at Coda. She's a hunting dog. Look how cute this hunting dog is. You see, these dogs they become tame like this when flies disappear. You see. They're very vicious when the flies come out. But then once the fly is gone, these dogs, they, they have their reward. Come on, Cody, let's go get a treat. Let's go get a treat, come on. Oh, a snake, fly me, a live snake. Well, it's okay, at least it's not a fly. Okay, better luck next time. Better luck next time with the snake. I know that the fly wanted to get it. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, that snake. Oh, it just jumped from nowhere. Here we go, here we go. Here we go. No! <laughs> oh, watch out, a bear! A bear! We've got to be careful about these woods. You, you never know if it's going to be a fly, a snake, a bear, but you never want to run into a fly. Out of all of these, a fly is the most dangerous of the creatures of this wild, wild, wild area. <laughs> Better luck next time. That's... The fly, the fly hunter down under.